we're trying to get several robotic vehicles to work together in unison to cooperate and perform certain tasks. So there are three main challenges uh, that we're going to participate in. Uh, one challenge involves us taking a drone off and finding a moving target in the competition arena and landing on it autonomously uh, without any human in the loop. And uh, challenge two involves getting a unmanned ground vehicle uh, which has an arm attached to it. It has to go out into the arena, find a board which has several wrenches of different size hanging on it and a valve next to it. So what they have to do is look at the valve, see what size wrench they need in order to turn it, grab that wrench, go over to the valve and turn it a certain amount. And challenge three involves using three drones to fly simultaneously, go and scout the field, find different colored targets, all of which are different, color, uh, different uh, number of points, uh, go down, grab them, and relocate them to a drop box in the middle of the arena. So we have a RTK GPS on board, which basically means a real-time kinetic GPS system, which helps us gain an, uh, uh, a location estimate within a couple of centimeters, uh, which is much more accurate than your standard GPS, which generally has a couple of meters accuracy, which is fine for most purposes, but for us, we're doing precision target capture, so we kind of need that higher um, accuracy. Uh, other than the GPS sensor, we've got two different cameras. We've got a, a gimbaled camera, which has a narrow field of view. And the other camera we have is the opposite. It's got a 180 degree field of view. It's a fisheye lens camera. So what we're trying to do is use our fisheye camera to get a view of the entire arena. So in the event that we're not completely able to describe an object just using that, we would point our gimbal camera towards that side and get more information about it. So it could be what kind of target is, is it? Is it a moving target or a static target? And what color is it? And that will basically tell us how many points it's worth. The point of this competition is sort of to put into framework and to put in, to sort of incentivize the research that is needed to use these things in day-to-day -day life, such as package delivery, to find, accurately find packages, pick, being able to pick them up and drop them to specified locations and such. So it's really setting the foundation for doing stuff like that in, in commerce, you know, and, and to make that a, a daily part of our lives.